I woke up every morning asking myself uh, this simple question of, is today the day I die? Because I did literally feel like I was going to die. And when you looked at my family history, it's a history of obesity. Uh, and so I thought I was just going to be the next one in line. Ten or 15 years ago, my life was pretty terrible. I weighed over 400 pounds, and I was sick, had a lot of you know, related issues that, that you would find with that. Uh, I was a graphic designer and working in New York, and I felt really awful, as I did every day. So I decided that I was gonna do something a little bit different. So for dinner, I had uh, just some plain chicken uh, with some vegetables, and I took that uh, back to my place, and I ate that, and I drank water instead of soda, and I felt really good the next day. So I did that a second day. By the third day, I felt like a new man. I called my wife and I said, we have to change things. Because I realized that it wasn't that the chicken I was eating was some kind of magical chicken that was making me feel better. It was all the other stuff that I wasn't eating. And so my wife and I went through our cupboards, got rid of all of the highly processed food, and we started just buying a whole fresh food and cooking our own food. When I first started this change, about the only thing I could do was walk. And so I would get up early in the morning and I would go for a walk. And it was just walking that helped me to lose a lot of that weight along with eating the uh, fresh food. And where I'm at today is uh, I'm living a much healthier lifestyle. I'm producing some of my own food and I'm just really enjoying uh, life. I'm a lot healthier. The reason I got into farming, it was a natural progression from knowing farmers, eating, buying good food from farmers to producing some of that food for myself. So currently, I'm on five acres, uh, my wife and two daughters. We raise pigs, chickens, and turkey, and we do a little bit of beekeeping, and we also garden. We have a mother garden where we grow most of our produce. We have a small orchard, and we have what's called a pig year where we produce uh, pigs, and we uh, start them from piglets and take them through to uh, harvest age, and, and then we uh, butcher them uh, here right on the farm. And then opposite years, we do chickens and turkeys. And uh, we produce about 80% of the meat that we eat. Our freezer currently is full of amazing, some amazing fresh pork. And it's just such a wonderful thing to go out there and to have so much to choose from. I think one of the issues out there that people have is uh, th that they don't have the space or that they don't have the time to do what we're doing. But before we moved out here, we were on a small plot in the uh, suburbs, but we still had a garden. We still were able to go and purchase food directly from farmers or go to the grocery store and purchase whole fresh foods. So there's always a way. You just have to start where you can start. Uh, as far as time, what's important? Uh, is, is your health, happiness, fitness, is that important? or something else important. You've got to prioritize things, and, and we prioritized uh, food, our health, our fitness, our family, and that turned out to be the best decision for us. My name is Richard Morris. I once weighed over 400 pounds and lost well over 150 pounds eating whole fresh foods.